what's up you guys i'm not doing a vlog i just wanted to say that elsa came through and did nothing um it was just another thunderstorm for us with just really high winds <laughs> um we floridians are used to this we're not new to this we are true to this okay that's how we go <laughs> um yeah that's all i wanted to come over here and say the sun trying to come out in the sunshine state you know what i'm saying so i'm excited <laughs> i like i don't like too strong of winds but i do like winds so i like weather in general it fascinates me but I'm finna get back to work. <laughs> I just wanted to come over here and say that. Elsa wasn't even formed when she got over us. <laughs> well, oh well, another day in Florida. Florida ish. <laughs> I'm not doing a vlog. Good morning, my vibrant beauties. It is Friday, July 9th, and I lied when I said the other day that I wasn't gonna start a vlog. Because I haven't been really into vlogging lately. I've been into making more like other content, but I feel like I need to because it is summer in Florida and I and you don't want to be caught in suede. No, I'm just playing. Um, <laughs> I am going to be getting out more. I need to get out more. I work from home. As you all know, I work from home, so it's kind of hard for me to get out and live my best life because um, I work Monday through Friday. Um, so sometimes the balance is off and it has been lately but this weekend is gonna be a different situation I think I want to see if I can order some Mexican street corn from this place that I love so much that only does the um, street corn on Fridays so I'm gonna see if I can order and go pick it up I think that's what it's gonna be to move because that's what I want in my life so I'm gonna probably get changed and go get some Mexican street corn. Oh, I also need to see if they have like the little, it's a Friday special with like lettuce tacos or something like that. So I'm gonna see, I'm gonna get that. want to show you all what I got so <sighs> I got lettuce tacos they're like beef tacos let me try to open this this is what it's looking like for my lettuce tacos right here this is my baby's he's he's not a taco person like that so but you know I didn't know what he wanted now I know because <laughs> he just called but these are the chicken tacos or shredded chicken these are the Mexican rolls oh my gosh they're so good they're I think mine are with shrimp but this sauce is amazing oh like this these are so good looks like I'm missing 
my big guac because I got the full order of guac and chips and this is the only guac they gave me that is not the full order so I'm gonna call back up there but this is the Mexican street corn it's so good they only serve them on on Fridays but that is what I'm gonna have for brunch basically because it is 103 so I'm gonna get back to work and get it cracking Ooh, cha. but yeah I'm gonna eat my food good morning I never ended anything for yesterday it is now Saturday um what the 10th yeah it's set on um, july 10th 2021 and i'm about to just like start washing laundry and things like that so i can get and go to the laundry mat to dry my clothes forever i'll explain to you why we do that even though we have a washer and dryer here but that is what i'm about to do i'm about to separate my clothes it's a lot and Let's get it back. is my laundry I separated them into four piles so we have towels you have my lighter colors you have my darker colors and you have my whites now some of my whites will be going in with my bedding because that's not enough whites to run a cycle but this is what I am doing today so let me tell y'all the reason why I go to a laundry mat to dry my clothes so we moved in in January as you all know go check out those move-in vlogs I will link them below but they did not tell us the measurements of the dryer vent and our dryer vent is a four inch in diameter and their dryer vent that comes from the wall the actual um what do you, i don't know what you call it the air way is three inches in diameter and there is no more reducers that will fit that um you either need like a a 4.5 or no you either need like a 3.5 or whatever because mine doesn't fit and if you try to force a, a small or the same size one on there and use it it's it can create fires so me she her is not going to do that so until we get into another place that has the the four inch in diameter then I will be consistently going to the laundromat or drying my clothes on the drying I mean, on the clothing rack. Um, my love, he has a drying rack, like a drying clothing rack that I bought like earlier this year, and he uses that because yeah, we're not trying to have no fires in this place, especially. I ain't even gonna get started on this place but yeah that is why I go to the laundromat and I wait so long because I don't like going to the laundromat it's just so much <laughs> but I'm doing that this morning so hopefully it gets done at least by one so I can like get dressed take some pictures 
um, and do a mukbang with my cousin. So yeah, that is what we are doing today. Laundry, cleaning, take IG pictures or just pictures in general, and a mukbang. So let's get into the day. Before everything is completely done, this I'm going to have some breakfast now. This is a paleo waffle that I made out of some purely Elizabeth paleo um, mix. So you can make pancakes out of it or you can make waffles. So I decided to make a waffle because I do have a waffle iron. And these are some chicken sausage with hot sauce on them and then... Um, pineapples which pineapples are really good for hormones so but this is my breakfast because I don't want to be out there looking crazy you know Ooh, cha, I'm still tired and because I have so much to do and I'm starting to get tired everything is now oops everything is done I'm just about to take it to my car so I can go but like I said, because I'm starting to get a little tired, your girl is going to go make her a matcha. So I'm going to show you my new way of how I'm making a matcha. It's pretty quick and easy. Hopefully I have enough ice because my love just did leave to go do his workouts. So he usually takes his big water jug and fills it with ice. It is like 90 something degrees in Florida. So who knows? So let's boogie woogie that. Tear it up. This is my waffle maker, you all. It's by Sunbeam. Great thing, I've had it for years. But this is my milk frother. It does four different settings and it can do cold. I'm going to take my Starbucks cup with a reusable straw I'm gonna fill this up with ice first so this is my ice this is the matcha I use I get it off of Amazon and then this is the agave I use I use the Oatly and this was in my coffee this morning I said it's putting on the cold setting which is the blue that is done I pour it in and it gets filled up to about right there so it's almost full but not quite then for the matcha part I fill it up to the minimum um, 
line which is kind of very low with uh, water any spring water or whatever will do filtered water but the minimum line is not that not that big so or not that high because you don't need a lot because this is like matcha matcha like this bad boy is potent now I took a scoop a scooper from my old vital proteins thingy and put it in here but I usually just take two of like that much and put it in here I may do another one yeah that's literally all I put here's how it looks and I put that bad boy on the second setting and it's going to heat it up and froth it at the same time but while that is going on I take my agave and I just pour it in about that much it's not too much but <laughs> not too much and then I proceed for more then I just stir it while I'm stir it while I'm waiting on the matcha. It's frothed, froth, and then I just pour it in there. I usually drink a little bit because it is kind of hard for me to close it. That is now how I make my matcha. And you can see the top is swirly. So you all, I got this frother from, or this, yeah, this frother, milk frother from Amazon. It's so much cheaper than an espresso, though I love my Nespresso machine that I have. That's what I make coffee with. But the milk frother for from Nespresso is like $100. This was like $35.40. So, and it works just fine. So, I got this and I'll link it down below. This is an Amazon, like an Amazon must have. So, now we have a new way to make matcha. Just saying. So, I'm going to clean this out and then load up the car to get ready to go to the laundromat. He got out of here so fast. I'm gonna have to go back and see the footage, but he got out of here so fast. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, but what is that gonna do? That shit hurt. But all of my clothes are now in the dryers, so I was able to stick them in about 
three dryers. So that's what I'm working on. Okay, y'all, it is the end of the night, so I'm sorry if it's a little dark. I am watching YouTube, so I'm watching the Batty Twins. I think they're hilarious. Update. We did not get to do the mukbang, unfortunately, so that was crossed off the list. Like, living in Florida, I will tell you, you will never have, like, a set day because it can be sunny, bright all day, but as soon as you want to take some pictures... It's, yeah, it's storming outside. And then I wanted to take some t pictures by the water, but there is red tide, so it stinks. So I don't think that's going to happen. Like, red tide is, like, bad. They shut down the beaches for it. But um, update, my little cousin, the one who I was supposed to do the mukbang with, got into a car accident, and we did not do the mukbang. So... That will be for another vlog. Um, right now, because I was lazy and hot earlier, I am now doing laundry. So there are literally clothes everywhere. I'm about to fold these so I can put on my sheets and everything. So what you just saw is basically the um, mattress topper so it's not like a yellow mattress it's just literally the mattress topper but I'm about to do that because so I can get in this bed I am tired it has been an eventful day um I don't know if you all saw but you probably saw it fall on me so at the laundromat I think I talked about this I guess he was the dude was trying to put his clothes into the laundry mat basket and the bad boy fell over and fell on me so my entire back of my arm on my left arm is sore as f okay that thing is ugh. but it wasn't his fault things just happened so today was not a day where anything got done besides laundry for me <laughs> So with that being said, I'm going to end this vlog here. I was going to carry it over until Sunday, but tomorrow is just probably just going to be, God willing, a calm, chill day. I'm, I may go grocery shopping and deep clean and then watch a movie with my love. But thank you all for watching this vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe below. And don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you know every time I upload. And with that being said, it's your girl Letty. And I'm out. Peace.